After seeing a lack of Asian American faces in the form of traditional Western portraiture, Chinese American artist Homer Shu used the photography to capture the faces of Chinese Americans. Using these pictures as reference, he then painted a series of portrait paintings, which are currently on display at 384 Broadway in an exhibition titled The Inscrutable Chinese. By taking an intimate, close observation of these faces, Homer delved into the topic of Chineseness and how Chinese people find and represent themselves in their own community, something that is often ignored. Alice Neal, this famous New York painter, she's painted a Chinese American, this guy Ed's son. He was in the show at, at the David's Warner, but it, there's only one, right? And so I looked at it and I was like, this is a rabbit hole I can really follow down. Like, I, I feel connected to this painting in a way that maybe she didn't even. And I would like to transit something through this. Because here's something where I just saw the catalyst of an opportunity, where I think she probably saw an end. And for me, when I'm looking for it, it I'm looking for people acting naturally and behaving in a way that um, says that they feel comfortable being Chinese in America. The audience, um, what I want them to take away is uh, a sense that, that people conduct their lives in a certain way, that, that in, in almost a, a different way and world from you know, other outside observers and that like, Chinese people in Chinatown and being Chinese in America has like a richness that you got, you can only slightly see here. The exhibition was made possible through the collaborative efforts of Think Chinatown, a collective of neighbors and advocates working to keep Chinatown a vibrant place with intergenerational learning, cultural production, and civic engagement. And Chashama, an organization supporting artists by giving them the space to create and present their works. After witnessing art galleries becoming more prevalent in Chinatown and bringing gentrification to the neighborhood, Think Chinatown has been exploring ways that galleries can do more with the Chinese community. With Homer's visual works capturing a slice of Chinese American life, Think Chinatown gives one possible answer to the question of how to bring relevant gallery exhibitions to the Chinatown local community. We wanted to investigate how uh, galleries in this area could do better to engage the community. So through selecting content that um, is more relevant to the community um, and through um, having docent-led tours in Chinese and Mandarin and Cantonese um, and through having activities that are bilingual. For instance, tonight we're having a poetry reading that is a bilingual one that we hope we can engage people who may not be used to coming into gallery space to feel welcome and be, um, be a part of everything going on.